Hi, my name is Adina Grubb and I make puppets for stop motion animation. They might be my own inventions, recreations of movie protagonists, or used in adverts or short films that I direct myself. I'm passionate about character design, storytelling, and little intricate things. Luckily, my job lets me combine all three. My typical style is cute, but with a weird or horror twist. If I'm referencing a well-known actor from a movie, I'll work hard to capture their essence, while also adding a personalized layer of charm. I love putting glasses and little tiny details on my figures. The great thing about puppets is that you can use them for mind-blowing animations and then keep them for display afterwards. Even if you don't want to put them in a video, you will still have a beautiful figurine that you can pose however and as many times as you'd like. In this domestic course, you'll learn the basics for creating puppets for stop motion. For the final project, you'll recreate a person you know or a character you've imagined or designed. First, I'll help you set up your workspace and plan your idea, including scale drawing and fabric swatches. <laughs> then it's time to build our little hero, starting with the armature and rigging. Next, we'll add upholstery foam, which acts like muscle or fat. Then we'll add some fabric skin. After that, we'll dress our puppet and finish up with the face, hair and accessories. Finally, I'll show you how to pose your character, take a few cute pictures, and create a very basic animation. At the end of the course, you'll have a tiny new friend who you can cast in your movies or exhibit as you see fit. To complete this course, you'll need balsa wood, aluminium wire, milliput, beads, fabric, felt sheets, and brass square tubes. You'll also want a jewelry saw, scalpel, glue, foam, and a cutting mat. Discover the unique and charming world of stop-motion puppet design.